Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I just received this small box. Okay, I bought it from Amazon. So let's open it and see what's, what's inside of it. All right, so I got this tool and I'm working on a car. So I saw like a good reviews on it, but what is that thing used for? What do you think? All right, I'm not gonna make it hard. I'll show you exactly what is this tool for. So let's get to it. All right, so I got this car here and uh, I was trying like to, to replace the inner tie rod. And guess what? I bought the tools that's supposed to work on it, which is the, uh, the one that I'm gonna show you later. But it turned out these new inner tie rods, they got no flat uh, spots. So the tools that I'm gonna show you later to grip on. So I found this tool here, which is designed for smooth inner tie rods. And uh, let's see like how effective is it and if it's gonna do the work or not, because I did try to open it by using a pipe wrench but if you guys can see like I really have no space to have a good grip I tried from the top it didn't work as well so let's give it a try and let's see how is this tool if it's gonna do the job or not okay so what I'm gonna what I'm gonna need to, uh, to put this in I'm gonna need the uh, socket millimeter just to put it in place Actually, not a little bit. Probably it's gonna need some. Okay. Let's look tight now. And uh, I'm gonna need some long extension to put it here. All right. Okay, here I'm gonna use my uh, extendable ratchet so I can put some uh, enough torque on it. Well, this thing it's kind of hard to break. Okay, so what I did here, I replaced my extendable ratchet with my breaker bar, and uh, hopefully that's gonna work. <sighs> All right, finally. Woof! I don't know how they designed this thing here. Okay, now while we break it loose. Try to untie the bolts.
All right, so if you're a mechanic, you're gonna know what I'm talking about. Look at this type of uh, inner road. It has no flat spots. The one that you can grip in, and I'm gonna show you the tools that I bought from Harbor Freight at the beginning, and uh, it really didn't work. Okay, if you are a DIYer and you're trying to make some YouTubes, this kind of stuff, I mean, uh, it's better to get this tool. It can fit on uh, almost of every uh, uh, every tie rod, I guess. And let me show you like uh, the tool that I bought. And you guys don't get me wrong. I mean, this tool, works perfectly for for a lot a lot of uh, a lot of uh, tie rod designs but the one that comes with the with the flat beside Okay, beside, if you're a mechanic, you're gonna know what I'm talking about. And this is how it's work. Like, let's say for instance, if you have the one with the flat spots, you can just slide it in like that. Then, this tool's gonna go directly inside. And then you have to lock your uh, wrench in and you're gonna use your half inch uh, breaker bar on it and that's worked pretty good i've tried it like a hundred times it's worked pretty good but sometimes you know uh car industry they keep changing their stuff i don't know they're trying to make it harder on us or something else so anyway uh, i hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video and uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel Please subscribe, that's going to help the channel a lot and I'll see you in the next video.